once I have this position, now I have a few things, okay? It's just like a few things can happen. So I go to this position, arm, boom. I go here, now look, I come to pull his arm, and let's say something happened, and he pulled, he extended his arm, extended his arm. It's hard to catch his arm, it's hard to hide his arm. What we're gonna do is, I'm gonna put my hand on the back of my neck here, okay? So now, I'm gonna look to the camera and say, <laughs> and then I, this is, I'm gonna control this arm now. So he cannot use this arm to push me away. The first thing is like, because I'm here, I, he's trying to do this, okay? So that's why I'm gonna catch his arm. Once he go to push me, push me, please. I can catch his arm and go for the return. We are first move. Okay, my head cannot be too high because in this leg has to be your base. And if you push my weight, this is always like for keeping, to keep me flat on the floor. Okay, so he, he'll hide his arm. So I'm gonna put my hand, he's in the back of the neck, has to be in the back, not here, okay? He's here, so trapping his arm. So if you try to push my face now, even if you can put his hand in front of my face, so I can catch him in the same position. So he's not gonna do this, this mistake, right? So now look. I can do a few things here. So like, uh, um, uh, when, if you guys do the, 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 the combat thing you guys do, you guys can start to smash yeah. the guy here. Boom, 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 okay? Which is a good chance for him to put his hand on it, start to defend here. Yeah, you can always catch his, uh, regardless if you punch or not, you can always catch the, the wrist here. So I'm catching outside the wrist, okay? I catch, and I'm gonna push down, and I'm gonna bring under my, my, my leg here, okay? And I cross the leg. Now look, like if you're doing that combat, if he, the guy hit you before, you throw a few here first. <laughs> and then you pull, and then you can put a hand here. So my hand then goes next to his head, right? So now with this leg, I'll move myself back and I turn it to my knees, okay? So look, he's a, a bit just do slow, okay? Because uh, some, if you have a flexible shoulder, so somebody has a shoulder tight, it's gonna be quite difficult. So look, one little thing here is, if my hips is far, it's gonna be quite difficult to reach this arm. So my hips has to be touching the arm, okay? So you can go, bang, 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 bang. <laughs> so I close on the, on the back of my leg here, and now I'm gonna cross my leg, this one on the back of my knee, right? So that's to stop him to extend his arm. My hand goes on the floor to stop his head to follow my leg. So because otherwise he's gonna keep following me, you know, I'm gonna tap him out. I wanna keep his hand, his body, his arm far from his, uh, his, uh, his body. So he lose the, the, the stretch on his shoulder. So my hand on the floor here, or I can grab the collar, whatever. I move a little bit back, close to his body, and turn. So as I turn, when I turn, I do this, look, this, pushing back. That's the direction. If I hit you this way, it's gonna, it's gonna break his shoulder, so, so be careful. So one, two, three, back and go. It's okay? So look, one more time, just to feel like a sequence. I got my partner here, attacking, he pushing his arm, extend your arm, extend your arm, a trap. You can go the punch or not, it depends on where you are today. Grab that, close, put my hand, and finish. Is that okay? Let's go. Mm -hmm.